Hi everyone, welcome back. We're here with Brooklyn Nine-Nine, Season 2, Episode 10, The Pontiac Bandit Returns. We've been waiting to close this loop. <laughs> uh, Jake got tricked, and the bandit got away, and he returned. So I'm excited to see in what way we're getting him back. Like, are we cat? Are we arresting him, or is it a slip up? Do we get to play cat and mouse again? I'm just super intrigued. So we're gonna jump into episode 10. The full length reaction is available on Patreon. You can check it out there. We have other exclusive movie and TV shows that we're reacting to there, so you can uh, stop by if you're interested. Also, if you'd like to support the channel, please subscribe and like the video. And yeah, let's just jump right into it. Merry Christmas! Any sign of our bogey? Negative. Oh. In 10 minutes, we're calling this. I have to get back to my ecstasy task force. Jake, holy crap, 9 o'clock. The Pontiac ah, Bandit. Hey, here Doug he Judy. is. Mary Judy, Mr. Doug's Judy. <laughs> Walt? <laughs> no! Come on, Santa, why are you so fat? NYPD, clear out. <laughs> gotcha. Oh. You're under arrest. Oh, Transmere. the fire department. Merry Christmas, girl. Shut up. This is what happens when you're naughty! <laughs> this truly is a joyful time. <laughs> Join me for a festive winter party. I can reiterate my gift policy. None allowed. I present to you... Doug Judy, a.k.a. the Pontiac Bandit. Wow! <laughs> you guys, thank you. <laughs> this is my moment. I can't help it. I'm proud of you. Like a son to me. How would that even work? Am I adopted? No, your mother's just really pale. <laughs> Shame I gotta ruin your celebration by cutting a deal and getting out of here. Never! Do not bite your lip. Y'all ever heard of Giggle, Giggle Pig? Giggle Pig. Dang. We're listening. No, 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 no. We're not listening. We can't hear him. You need to see this. It's from him to your mom. No. Yes. Presence is like old people third base. They may be getting serious. Uh. <laughs> you think I want you and your mom horny in on the Boyle Boys Mimosa Brunches? What if it's a romantic book or like his and hers pajamas? The kind that dissolve in your mouth. Boyle, you are spicy. I'm making a Christmas present for Captain Holt. I know he has a strict no gift policy, but... Like your loophole last year? I asked the captain what qualified as a gift. Anything I spent money on. My time is worth nothing. <laughs> A sad statement. I'm making a scrapbook of his professional highlight from Ray to Z. Very bad idea. But my backup was keep holding on. I'm actually not mad about keep holding on. Is Giggle Pig really that important? The fate of this entire precinct all depend upon that scores. Hey, the only way we make a deal with Doug Judy is if he can give us the top guy. I can give you Tito Ruiz. Oh, I mean, how do we even know this is real? This guy's a huckster. True. How can we trust him? He texted me last week. Need some cars to deliver his product. Rosa, Rosa, <laughs> Rosa. He's not having it. Enough crooning. Crooning. You gotta give me zero jail time. Five years instead of 20. I can see why you have such intense daddy stuff with him. Put me up in a five-star hotel like the Royce. Three-star hotel. $60 a day meal allowance. No mini bar. 200 in food. No mini bar or alcohol. Agreed. Ow! Mm. Diaz has to be nice to me. Mm. I want her to call me Big Sugar. She'll never agree to that. No, I'm in. <gasps> Big Sugar. Uh, what? I want to be on this case. Pontiac Bandit and Jake. PB and Jake. Reunited and it He's getting away. Must be understood. No, no. You tried. All right, Big Sugar. You happy? Okay. I'm gonna go freshen up. I'm feeling stanky. Not so fast. All right, there's no windows. You can go in. Would you just relax, okay? Stop being so paranoid. I got you. Better get GPS tracker in his shoe. Lobster terminal. It's so fancy, it don't even sound like food. Do it. Or no thanks. I'm on duty. You gonna let the criminal have all the fun? <laughs> all right, fine. You know how we take this to the next level? Robes. Ah, uh -uh, at... <laughs> <laughs> if only he was a police officer and not a criminal. They could have been the best of friends. I always open my gifts in advance so I can rehearse my reaction. Bewonderment. <gasps> Barkle surprise. <laughs> I like that. Your dad got my mom. A digital scale? My mom is gonna hate this gift. Should we do a gift exchange dinner tonight with both our parents? Maybe she'll slap him in the face and never talk to him again. Sparkle surprise! 
real. Caesar salad with tater tots instead of croutons. Oh, that's me. I know, Rosa. Body's a temple. Whoa, 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 whoa. Peraza, what you doing? How am I supposed to escape using a lobster? Squeeze the lemon in my eyes, stab me in the jugular with a claw. Stop giving him ideas. I'm all about helping you. We held up our end of the bargain. Text Ruiz now. Tito do. He spooks real easy, so I've already got my cover story worked out. My name is Dante Thunderstone. You had to fan for yourself since your mother was struck by lightning <laughs> while she was pregnant with me. Some say that makes Zeus my dad. And Rosa, you could be my wife. Because we partners in everything we do. Mm -hmm. Tito wants to meet up. Great. Has Captain Holt ever told you about the Brooklyn broiler? <sighs> you flamed out. Dirt bag. Well, I think the captain may have made a mistake. I was doing follow-up research, where are they now section. I don't think the broiler set three of the fires he was charged with. <laughs> Next year, you can do a collage about low points in his marriage. But I really do love making collages. Amy! Tito, what's up, my man? Who are they? How's my bodyguard, Selena? He's an amazing lover. I'm pregnant. Nice! My partner, <laughs> Dante Thunderstone. I love when she plays along. Because I gotta see how good you really are. Go jack that car right now. There's no way you're getting in that car alone. Where are you going, Thunderstone? I jacked the rides. Judy holds my tools. Now I just need to what magically learn do? how to steal a car. Blah, blah, blah. Something wrong? Nope. Warming up my stealing fingies. I always start with a side to side sway. Hop it! Hot! Oh, yeah! Look at him teaching you how to. <laughs> it's like French kiss. Jam it in there and move it around wildly. Do the ladies enjoy that technique? Ah, uh, yeah! Thank you. Yeah, fun Christmas four-way. Oh my God, don't say that. Oh my God, I have an idea. Let's open presents. I just hope you like it. <laughs> no. A digital scale. You're a horrible, horrible man. And I love it. <laughs> what? what? Lynn and I are moving in together. <gasps> yeah, my oh poo gosh. The poo. What is going on? I am needed elsewhere. Thank you so much. <laughs> Nog nog. So, um, I think I may have found a mistake in a closed case. It's the Brooklyn broiler. What? That dirt bag flamed out ages ago. It flamed out ages a ago. Gift. Not a gift, snitch. From Ray to Z. Take this away and bring me the broiler's file. The evidence is part of the scrapbook, so I have to leave the whole thing. I'll look at the relevant pages, but as for the rest, I will not peruse. <laughs> So we gonna make a deal or what? People know they shouldn't ask dumb questions. What the heck? Is that us? No. And my weeding, nobody move. Bye bye, Peralta. Here's your GPS. <sighs> no! But your boy Tito's getting away. No! I'll never forget you, Dante Thunderstone! <laughs> You have the right to remain Doug Judy. I'm preoccupied by someone who will <laughs> remain nameless. I knew he was gonna get away. I wanna thank you for my gift. I'm a man of my word, so I did not peruse. Referring <laughs> to as you pointing out my mistake. You know why I don't accept gifts? Because I don't like brown nosing. You told me to my face that I made a mistake, and that's as far from brown nosing as one can get. Mm. Will you please help me figure out who set those other fires? More work! I know that sounded sarcastic. Nobody but... thought that. I know. <laughs> Jazz, my dad. I've never had more purpose in my entire life. What is your Are purpose? You my dad. No. <laughs> need to break them up for their sake. But they're happy. Agreed. I'm sorry to interrupt your holiday revelry. I'd like to propose a toast to Detective Diaz, who successfully brought down the entire Giggle Pig network. Drink up. Yeah. Doug Judy still hasn't surfaced. Yeah, he has. What's up, Peralta? This is my associate, Kyle. The room service waiter I had you tipsy. <gasps> Son of a I And we ordered the lobster that. and it was code for Kyle to follow. Hell, Dia, she loves me. I swear to you we are going to catch Doug Judy. I know how hard that was to make that choice and let him get away. I know how much this task force means to you. You mean so much. <laughs> it went so well. <laughs> I cannot stop smiling. I know. How do people it's... do this with their faces? All right, we knew he was gonna get away. As much as that like hurt to get to to let him go, but maybe it is better off this way because that means that there's a chance we are going to get to meet him again down the line. Because if we if we lock him up, it's not like Jake is gonna go and like visit him in the prison or something. So better he gets away somehow, somewhere we might get to hang out again. <laughs> You gotta admit, they like get they get along so well, or at least he knows how to play Jake so well. It's so funny that moment they like 
Like Jake was fighting so hard in, in the beginning to to not like give in to his uh, to not like get carried away and excited when he was like trying to describe a good time but as soon as like they put on the robes <laughs> the, the reunited song <laughs> that was a wrap for him <laughs> had his blinders on uh, but yeah great episode nice to see rosa smiling in the end the giggle pig has finally we finally gotten that giggle pig like i in the uspis episode i was legit even expecting somewhere down the line for that agent to like turn around and um like still somehow be involved but nope he wasn't involved and i can't believe i didn't recognize him from the hangover what a what a fail what a fail <laughs> and then amy of course with her gift she still went against his wishes for the gift and found a mistake which honestly i who would have thought that bringing the mistake to light is actually a better gift for him because it shows that it's not her brown nosing uh, and then of course boyle and gina's parents moving in together wow like for one moment i i was like the way Gina was so happy in the end, I got I got kind of concerned, but then it turns out, yeah, they just want to break apart their parents. But you know, now I'm actually like, the way they're so happy, just let them be. Let them be. But a great episode. Full length reaction again is available on Patreon. You can check it out there. Come and chat it up with us over on Discord. I hope y'all are staying safe, and I'll catch you in the next episode. Bye, y'all.